How's it going YouTube? Today we're working on a 2023 Ram 1500. This one is a limited but should be the same steps depending on you know whatever uh, model you do have. Uh, these door panels are kind of tricky and it does feel like you're breaking them in the process. So that's why I'm going to go ahead and make this video kind of show you guys uh, how I do it and hopefully kind of save you guys some hassle. But the entire door panel is actually put on by push pins and the older Dodges used to have rivets on the outside then you would pull up on them but on these newer styles it's, it's all push pin even all the way across the top of the uh, uh, door panel but first we'll go ahead and start off by pulling our panels off we have one behind the grab handle and then one behind the door handle the one behind the door handle is kind of tricky because there's a a push pin and the corner how they did this one so just kind of put your pick in it and then start off in that corner that way you don't give any stress marks and then just pry on that first and it should pop free all right, this is the cover that's behind the door handle. This is the clip I was telling you guys about. Whenever you pry on this, you wanna actually pry on the clip itself. So see this little cutout? So when you come in with your pick, you wanna kinda of go in and pull on the clip itself. Because you come up here and you start prying, you're gonna leave like a big white stress mark on the outside of this cover. Don't know why I dodged it this way, but, oop, almost dropped it again. Don't know why I dodged did it this way, but that's how they did it. So just be careful when you're putting these tabs out because you definitely wanna damage a customer's car. The one behind the grab handle is pretty simple. You just kind of put your pick in there, pry it down on it, and it pops out. All right, now we have all of our covers off, which will show the two bolts behind the grab handle and the one behind the door handle. They are a size 10, so we'll go ahead and take those out. All right, now we're at the fun part, which is actually taking the door panel off. It's not really fun. The pins on these particular door panels are super tight and they're kind of hard to get out. So just grab the thickest panel popper that you have and just kind of work your way on the bottom and kind of work up. Once you get it going, it's kind of simple, but it just feels like you're breaking it at first. So just kind of find a sweet spot. It might take you a couple of tries to find that sweet spot. Like I was saying earlier, there's push pins that are holding on this top row as well. They used to slide up and out, but now there's push pins, so just gotta, gotta be careful with that. And just find which corner will give you access. There it goes. So let me set up the camera and kind of show you guys what I'm talking about. All right, sorry for the bad angle. I just wanna show you guys this before we move on to the driver door. These are all these push pins I was telling you guys about. They're kind of a pain to get off, but this top row is all held on by push pins as well. I uh, used to be able to just unbolt the bolt and slide up on the door panel, but now the entire door panel is held on by push pins. Not sure why Dodge went this route. It's kind of a pain sometimes, but once you get used to it, it's not too bad. We just got push pins. You see the female end right here all the way across. It's just kind of a pain, but once you get used to it, it's not too bad. But now we'll move on to the front door. All right, now we're on the front door. Same procedure, we'll take our covers off. Remember, going with your pick at an angle. It might kind of give you a trouble at first. The time is probably on that corner. And then I'll pop free, so we got that one off. And then we'll go ahead and take off the one behind the grab handle. Take our three bolts out. Grab our thick panel popper and just kind of find a sweet spot again. This one's being a pain. Another thing is sometimes on this corner be careful because you don't want to split it. So sometimes I'll bring the armrest side up halfway and then I'll work kind of around and 
pop the top. Because sometimes these will split off. You don't definitely don't want to break this. on this the, on the uh, the front two doors so you don't break the plastic off the back side but besides that there you guys go so that's how you take off the panel on the back door and the front door on a 2023 ram 1500 thanks for watching